It's time to start the game, and I'm going to go for this guy right here. You wake up in your apartment in the year 2032. Very interesting indeed. What are we going to find here? Looks like it's gonna take some time for it to load fully. And, um, we're almost there. Good morning, Morgan. Today is Monday, March 15th, 2032. Objective. Press O to open transcribe. Alex convinced me I'm going to join him aboard the Talos 1 space station. The work we are doing up there is too good to pass up. Plus, he says he's got a surprise. I have to jump through some hoops at the training center before I board the shuttle. Put on your Tran Star uniform. First day on the job. Put on your Transtar uniform. Okay. Before we do that, look at that. Drink. It looks like I'm a bit dizzy here. Heart of Walk. Excerpt from Chapter 5 of Heart of Walk by P. Sudu. Cooking with a well seasoned walk can be a sublime, almost spiritual experience. The many layers of the blackened surface are like stored memories of all the meals that have gone in and out of the carbon steel bowl before, now importing echoes of the rich flavor to vary the meal it is tasked to cook. Alright, let's see what's that. <clears throat> it looks like... Um... Oh wow, look at that. Drop, throw, okay. Ha! Wasn't expecting that really. Mouse drop, F drop, mouse uh, throw. Okay, it looks like uh, most of the stuff can be picked up. Encyclopedia of Food Science and Cooking, excerpt from an entry in the Encyclo Encyclopedia of Food Science and Cooking. 2033 edition by Elliot and Shaw transglutaminase TG or TGAC a naturally occurring enzyme found in plants animals and bacteria TG is often used to bond protein containing foods together and in the production of foods such as imitation crab 
meat and fish balls, known colloquially by chefs as meat glue. <coughs> Chef Shostib, gluing chicken skin to salmon will actually protect the outside of the salmon from overcooking. It doesn't say turn off. Look at that, it doesn't say turn off. Alright, what is that? I can throw things around here quite a, quite a bit. I like that. Can I enter the shower? I suspect it's going to turn itself off. Interesting. Not a shower though. Yeah, everything turns itself off. Look at that, I'm in my socks. Carry okay, search. Nothing. Nothing. Climb. I can climb here? Oh wow, look at that. I'm on top of that. Enter password. F paradox? F paradox? Examine use object. Tutorial. Trans star employee workstation often contains useful information files and utilities. Press T to view more. Workstations. Many Tronstar employees have private workstations. Lockstations require passwords. Search the environment for clues or use the hacking ability to bypass the login. Workstations may contain an email, files to download, or special utilities. Alright, it looks like uh, we've got ourselves an email. Congratulations and welcome. Hello, Margam. So glad to hear you will be coming aboard soon. Your first official work day is Monday, March 15, but first we have a series of training exercises we run with all new employees, just <coughs> some stuff to clear you for life in orbit. Exciting times ahead, have a good flight and I will see you soon. Thomas Tucker, Human Resources, Talos Research Facility. Delivery from Alex Yu. Hey, I sent a package with everything you will need for your first day. Uniform, transcribe and neuromod. Install neuromod right away so we will be running some tests for first thing in the morning. Just follow the instructions. I will be in touch. Ready? Hey. Oh wow. I just like use my mouse button. Let's quick save. Hey, I just got off the phone with mom and dad. They won't be there when the shuttle departs. They are in New York, company stuff, <clears throat> but they send their best. I think mom's a little disturbed that both her children are going to be outside her gravitational pull at the same time. She said you would be better behave and do everything your big brother says. Okay, actually, she said the opposite. I'm supposed to behave and do what you tell me, so there you go. That's mom. Anyway, everyone's excited about your ideas up there, so get ready. I will probably call you in the morning to make sure you're up so you ever see you very, very soon Alex okay now let's uh, put that suit on new objective Get the helicopter, helicopter on the roof. Do I have a map? I'm not sure, but look at that. There's a door here. Unfortunately, that wasn't a big deal. Door locked here. Morning, Mr. Yu. Heard there's a chopper on the roof. Must be for you. Okay, let's go. They still have elevator music though. That's the roof. 
faxes and it looks like here's the helicopter. Mr. Yu, please make yourself comfortable and we'll be on our way. Transtar facility is just a short hop. 78 degrees, clear skies all the way. Looks like I'm very, very important if I can plug the helicopter in the city itself. That's a nice view on the bay there. Exactly. Mr. Yu. Mind the glass on the way out. Good luck to you. Hello, Dr. Yu. You have to be joking. You're such a disgusting robot. This robot doesn't even have a face. I'm a Sybil 495 science class operator. I would say that the robot needs a face. Welcome, Morgan Yu. You have a 9 a.m. appointment in the testing facility. Please confirm. Confirm. Let's go. I wonder, was that floors? Or just time? Morgan. A different time. Finally. Oh, that's a serious face. Look at that face. Hey, you don't look terrible in a Transtar uniform. How's your eye? Still red? I know the test might seem a little unconventional, but it's a you family tradition. Breaking convention is in our blood. Once you start the test, just do whatever comes natural. Don't overthink it. Dr. Bellamy's gonna walk you through the process. You're in good hands. We'll be in orbit next week. I promise. Mr. Yu, they're ready for your brother in room A. Right. Oh no, Listen, look at those ugly faces. Just be yourself. I'll see you after. All right, all right. I wish I could show you what I've been working on. Wow. Okay, let's get uh, some room. The methods... SCI, except from Architects of the Neurological Revolution. What if I told you I could turn you into a mathematician on the level of Einstein in under 10 minutes? I would say you're full of shit. No, I will say you're full of it. That's the first thought that crosses my mind. But it withers in the face of Alex Yu's conviction. Despite myself, I'm riveted. He's not bullshitting me himself. Maybe. Me? Not? No? Alex leans back in his chair. Welcome to the age of Neuromond. No, no, no. I wonder what's that all about. It looks like Good they morning, Morgan. Me. I'm Dr. Bellamy. Looks like we have some tests to run through today. Probably not the kind of thing you're used to, I imagine, but trust me, you're going to do fantastic. All good? Great. Let's begin. For this first test, I'd like you to remove the boxes from the red circle as quickly as you can. Just go with your gut. Okay? Wonderful. Press the red button when you're ready. Alright, let's do this. 
Okay, our objects are deaf. Wonderful. That's... You're absolutely fine. Uh, let's move on to room B, then. Alright, let's go there. Okay, Morgan. Listen carefully. I'd like you to do your best to hide in this room. Take your time, relax, think it over. No, I'm kidding. You only have nine seconds. Hit the red button when you're ready to start. Morgan, we can see you there. Fine. Hmm. Uh, any synaptic register? At all? No? no? That's fine. Sorry, let's keep things moving, Morgan. All Head right. into room C. We're doing marvelous. Alright, if only the door would open. Alright. Here we go. For this test, Please press the blue button across the room as quickly as you can in the most natural, intuitive way possible, without thinking. Just, just go for it. Press the red button when you're ready. All right. I'm sorry, can someone please explain to me what's happening? Simmons? I installed exactly what Tina brought down. Did you double check? The speaker's still on. I apologize, Morgan. We're having some trouble with the equipment. Not your fault. You're doing fabulous, actually. One last room. Let's step into D. All right. Now, now, now. Can someone get me a cup of coffee? I would appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, Morgan. Have a seat at the table for me, please. I'm at the table. Was I not at the table? Okay, it looks like I wasn't at the table. Wonderful job. Take a look at the screen in front of you. I'm going to show you a series of questions. Pick the answer that makes the most sense to you. Press start on the screen when you're ready. All right. You're planning a vacation. Go somewhere familiar you know you love or try something new. Whenever you're ready, yeah. Morgan. Good. Looks like you've got the hang of it. Keep going. You have been sentenced to death for your actions. How does this make you feel? Afraid? I don't know what will happen. Angry? No one has the right comment. It was worth it. Ooh, that's heavy stuff. A runaway train is bearing down five people who are tied to the track. You can cause the train to switch tracks, but there is one person tied to the second track. Switch tracks. Yeah, switch tracks. Good. Next. A runaway train is bearing down on five people. You're standing on the platform next to an enormously fat man. Pushing him into the track would stop the train. Oh, that's interesting. I should not commit the murder, so I'm not gonna do that. Almost done. A runaway train is bearing down five people tied to the track. You could stop the train by jumping onto the track, but you would die. Jump on the track, push the fat man, do nothing. Interesting. I don't want to well die. Done. For well those people. done. We're nearly through it. For this next part, I'm going to display an image. I want you to take a good look at it. In a moment, I'm going to ask you what. Uh. Is my coffee? It's empty. Oh, wow. And it looks like they attack me. 